All right, welcome to day 33 of my 60-day challenge. I want to show you this flute today. It's called Dizza, D-I-Z-I. Now, the interesting thing about this flute, it's a Chinese flute, is that it has an extra hole on it. This is where you play this hole, and this is an extra hole. When that hole is uncovered, it sounds like this. Does not work, okay? What we need is some of this thin membrane. And what this does is it covers the hole, but it vibrates, it buzzes, it gives it a buzzy timbre that makes me think of a, of a kazoo. Sorry, I don't mean to offend anybody by comparing it to that, but it reminds me of a kazoo. If you've ever played a kazoo and examined how it really works, it's a thin piece of tissue paper that when you're humming over it, it creates that buzzy sound. And I've got here a glue stick. Now this is not the traditional <laughs> thing to use, but it works fine and it is water soluble, so I can get that back off real easily. I'm gonna take this tissue paper and I'm going to crinkle it up a little bit. We actually want some little bit of a little bit of texture to that. I don't know how well you can see that. And I'm gonna put it right on that hole. Let's see if I can get this close. Okay, so I'm putting this across the hole. I think my light's a little too bright actually. But anyway, can you see that? Now I'm not great at this. I'm not a crafty kind of guy. <laughs> and I think I actually got this a little too tight. Let's see what it sounds like. Okay, so it's playing and you can hear that buzzy timbre that is common for this instrument. I just thought I'd show you how that works and I am now going to stop the camera and select a traditional Chinese tune to play for you.